Hey everyone, I don't know about you, but I got a head start on some holiday shopping this past weekend. In stores, big stores, small stores, and online. And according to the Verizon Holiday Retail Index, I wasn't the only one enjoying some online shopping over the weekend. In fact, e-commerce traffic was up almost 30% throughout Black Friday weekend. Jeremy called Michelle Dupre in Chicago to learn more. Michelle is part of the Verizon Enterprise Solutions team that produces the Holiday Retail Index. Michelle, thanks so much for joining me. Uh, first off, what is the Holiday Retail Index? Great. Thanks, Jeremy. So the Holiday Retail Index by Verizon Enterprise Solutions, um, we're in our fifth year and what we're really doing is tracking the trends associated with digital or, or e-commerce traffic um, and comparing it to 2017, comparing that to 2018. Um, and really what we're looking for trends that we see in overall consumer engagement. Talk me through what you've seen so far and then how the retailers can keep that momentum going. So what we've seen so far this year is that retailers um, got off to a very early start with doing Black Friday sneak peeks. So that started November 1st. And what we see is that that's paying off. When you look at the results that, um, that happened the weekend before Thanksgiving, we saw an increase there, 4.19% um, and almost a 15% on Sunday. And then that momentum carried through the entire week leading up to Thanksgiving. And then really just um, Black Friday and the weekend following um, we saw really, you know, strong increases overall. So again, I think it's that momentum that we no longer see these peaks and valleys and the challenge for retailers will be to keep their consumers and their customers engaged with their brand throughout the, uh, the entire month of December. Thanks, Michelle. You can see the full report and the full conversation between Jeremy and Michelle online. Now, whether you're shopping online or in store, you still need some gift ideas for those in your life. Well, our resident gadget guy, Steve Van Dinter, was recently on the local Fox affiliate in Salt Lake City, giving some gift ideas for the tech lover in your life, including the Verizon exclusive Google Pixel 3. This is by far far and away my favorite. Um, so this is the new Google Pixel 3. Mm. Reason I picked this one out, most people use a smartphone now for the photography. That's it's like, true. you know, we, we carry it around, we document our lives, Instagram, whatever. Yeah. I love this camera because you can break photography rules. This is me a couple weeks ago on the top of the Empire State Building. You see the sun behind me. This is normally a big photography oh, that's a no, -no. no no. Yeah. <laughs> but notice I'm not I'm not you know shadowed. It looks like uh, you're front lit. It looks like I got someone with the bounce light in front of me. That is um bizarre. that's the beauty of it. It uses computation photography so Google's computer actually will enhance certain areas of the picture to make it look right to you they also just pushed down a feature called night sight so what this means is if you're in a darkly lit area let's say you're out for a night on the town mm -hmm. you're trying to take pictures of like your neighborhood with the the holiday lights up and things mm -hmm. like that this will enhance all those areas it really makes uh, pictures where there's no light look amazing I, I mean like, like well lit <laughs> blows, your, blows your mind kind of amazing Steve has been sharing some great photos he's taken with that Google Pixel 3 so be sure to follow him on Twitter Twitter for more. You can also see some other gift suggestions from that segment online, including the Tile and Verizon exclusive Palm. Well, that'll do it for us today. Be sure to follow us on social for everything happening around and inside Verizon. Until next time, you're up to speed.